Thomas Kirkwood's the king of the universe, and I'm back with another one. Someone is just choosing to stand in front of the window. I'm gunagali. I'm dark. I don't wanna get darker than this. But anyway, welcome to Snake and Fashion Zone. Yeah. So first things first, if I drop all the information and the updates, like, subscribe, share, you know, comment down below. Hey, gentlemen, I should, I should have dropped this video sometime last week, but because of the Kendrick and Drake beef, I just had to, you know, take a step back. Because now, <laughs> Drake dropped the shoe, and I, you know, it's bad, eh? So apparently Drake dropped the shoe, it's the Noka um, Nike Hot Step 2 in Triple White, which dropped on the 9th of May. Uh, 2024 which was retailing for 3.7 it dropped via next nigga z8 mm -mm, it didn't sell guys the shoe did not sell hey it's it's it, it, it's that bad hey eh? yeah i no. there's nothing i can say personally the shoe is ugly by itself i've been singing this song since this collab has been going on. at some point they dropped the shoe in orange who in their right minds will wear an orange shoe eh? I don't want to get cancelled. Anyway, so New Balances announces its multi, multi-week celebration of Grey in May. So what they're doing is they're just dropping a bunch of collection of shoes in grey color mostly. Alright, so it's celebrating the history as well as uh, being part of, you know, the sneaker game for almost 10 years, creating some of the best cake, being an innovative, you know, creating shoes from running into fashion. Well, the running shoes now, we just turn them into fashion. You know so the first launch happened on the first of may which they launched via the night i'm not like via the new balance stores and um, the website as well which was www.newbalance.co.za and then the second drop happened on the 10th of may they dropped a 327 a 327 a 574 a 550 and a 530 right and then on the 17th of may they also dropped the Grey Days WR uh, PT Runner and the 1906R. And then on the 20th of May, they are dropping the Fresh Foam, the Fresh Foam uh, 1080 Grey. So those are the kicks that will be dropping. At the moment, the prices are not mentioned, but when you do visit the website at www.newbalance.co.za, you should get all the information and the prices. And remember, when you see something that says set at it means that is the beginning of the price it doesn't mean that's the actual price because now you don't understand if they say set at it means that's where the prices might start at going upward whatever happened from that going up has nothing to do with me but i'm just giving you guys you know and then puma just decided to drop another banger another collab more clothing and more shoes they call it the um a all new genderless collection called a palamo spain this is a collection that showcases a celebration of queer identities i please don't cancel me i'm just saying that's what's written here. which is the 18th athletic culture and the trace of the 70s roller disco it embodies a fusion of retro flair a contemporary touches with premium uh, fabric distinctive logos trims and a rich color palette of warm tones right so the appeal they offer a t-track um jack what a check suit jacket and track pants in warm white and tech hey guys colors man warm white until I have, a, until until they manufacture a car that is dark white, I'll buy it. Until then, they I grab. So these are the prices of everything that's dropping. Now the Puma Palomo Spain loafer, which is the kick, uh, is retailing for 4.4. The Polaramo, which is the other kick, with uh, retailing for 2.4. And then the grip bag is retailing for 3.5. And then the T7 track jacket is retailing for 4.5. A uh, Spain top is retailing for 3,000. A graphic tee is retailing for 1.1. T7 shorts are retailing for 4,000. And then the top is retailing for 3,000. Hey, that is very expensive. Yo, imagine. Imagine. So high tech is also celebrating 50 years in running time. Yes. <laughs> So this brand was founded back in 1974 by an English shoemaker, Frank Van Wiesel, 
which was inspired by outdoor activities, right? Uh, from the park stroll to the mountain climbing, they prioritize quality, comfort, and innovation. In the celebration of the 50th anniversary, the brand honors its iconic style with a new range, or with a new range featuring classics like the Squish Classic 94, the Silver Shadow 1891, and the PCT 1985. The prices were not mentioned, but I do encourage you to go visit www.hightech.co.za or .com and then all the prices and everything are there. So I'm guessing that this type of release will be happening as the month goes by. So that means on the next drop dates or picks, I will probably let you know guys what's happening, right? And then Converse has decided to drop another banger. Well, bangers would tell the creator we all know man the golf play fair with the chuck 70 low digital uh leopard pen now they come in four different colorways which is pink green blue and brown they're all highlighted by a glitchy digital leo um leopard uh print upper right so if you are looking to get the kick you can get them at converse Sunton city uh, or www.converse.co.za they're retailing for 2.2 each yep so they're not playing. Last but not least, if you know Skepa, Skepa is actually one of the best rappers, well, underground rappers, right? So most people know him for his work with Nike. And yes, now he has just decided to join forces with Puma to create one of the most expensive, yeah, I appeal, shoes, everything is just made expensive. I don't know why, but that's not my job. So the collection screams Skepa's dress code as a tracksuit mafia. Featuring a salty color palette emphasizing material like platinum uh, premium nylon offset by a silver hardware inspired by Puma's origin including accessories like a backpack, gloves and a beanie. So everything is dropping on the 18th of May 2024 via shelf life, right? Now, the Puma, the Puma Skepta Forever, the kick is retailing for 3000 the track jacket is retailing for 65 the vest is retailing for 5000 the track pants are retailing for 3.5 the backpack is uh 2.5 the gloves are a thousand bucks and then the bean is 600. don't ask me i'm not the one selling bro i just buy if i can you know what i mean so 